All right, I am at the summit of Mount Washington. I'm here with my wife. Who? She's somewhere. There she is. Over there. Back there. Oh, well, I just realized I was pointing at the camera and you can't see it. I figured might as well show you. Up here, it's too high. There ain't no, ain't no trees. So, uh, no chainsaws needed up here. I think it's about 6,000 uh, 6, feet up. But, uh... I'll go ahead and on the way back down, we'll, we're going to stop all different places and uh, take a lot of pictures and I'll just add them into the video, just pictures to look at and stuff and uh, hopefully you like it. It's beautiful up here and I, I, I see this place as uh, every married man knows what it's like to have to catch himself and go, man, I'm married to a beautiful woman. And that's the way it would be if you lived up here. You take it for granted and you go, oh yeah, it's just normal life. But then all of a sudden, you got to stop and understand up here in New England. It's just beautiful. And the, the birch trees, they're just bright white. And of course, all of the popping colors of autumn. It's uh, amazing. And I'm amazed at myself right now because I've withheld... The temptation to give a really shitty accent, a wicked bad accent of a, of a New Englander. Anyways, I hope you like the video. Well, it's scary in the car, so I'm sure it's scary in a train too. Well, as the cog train's going down the mountain. See, that's that wicked bad accent <laughs> I hope I don't offend anybody by it but it's fun to play around all right I'm about ready to go down say hello Irene hello Irene hey So I just learned that all of these uh, little pa piles of rock, they mark the trail. So I never knew that before. If you're a hiker, you want to hike up this. Uh, over there, you see those lines in the mountain? Yeah, there you go. That's a ski slope. beautiful country here and up there look at that can you where's that one, I, one of these rocks has a pile of clothes on it and my guess is that's where the guy from fire in the sky <laughs> was abducted and his clothes got left behind <laughs> you remember that old Muffy D.V. Sweeney. He was a logger. See, isn't that funny? <laughs> oh, as soon as I saw it, I thought, oh, D.V. Sweeney's clothes and he got abducted. <laughs> Fire in the sky, ABC special, or something like that. That's amazing. <laughs> Probably a lot of these trees are ash. I just don't know which ones they are because I know ash is kind of popular uh, popular up here that's it's just beautiful yeah that's good so yeah so I would think that clearly these all three are the same tree 
But obviously, look how white that one is. That's interesting. Maybe it's just a different species of beach. I don't know. Maybe one's beach and one's something completely different. If you know, put it in the comments. But I love these white ones. Man, they're beautiful. That's amazing. <laughs> Probably a lot of these trees are ash. I just don't know which ones they are. Because I know ash is kind of popular. Uh, popular up here. That's just beautiful. 